Hey, this is Vegeta, the Prince of All Saiyans, and this is SSJ Goshen 4. Her figures are over 9,000! Hey guys, this is Goshen 4 here, back again with the new Dragon Ball unboxing for you guys. And today, got a couple of new things. It's not going to be like a huge unboxing, but I wanted to show you what I got in the past, like, maybe week or a week and a half or so. I'm excited to open these two boxes that I have here. I have one already opened, but I really want to show you guys anyway. But two I have not opened. So, all right, let's start with the small box first. All right, and the small one actually got some fan mail from Ignacio, which I really appreciate. Thank you so much for sending this. You didn't have to. Thanks, dude, you're the fucking best. <laughs> you really did not have to send anything to me, but I really appreciate that you did. So he is from Wisconsin. So uh, let's check out what he sent me. Fan mail, to be honest, I'm probably going to open a P.O. box soon so I can actually do a segment for fan mail. That would be awesome. I would really enjoy that. So um, hey, that might be coming in the near future. But uh, let's see what Ignacio sent. Oh, he sent me two things here. Very cool. All right, the first thing. Hey, some Dragon Ball stickers! Thank you, man. That's awesome. These are like not regular stickers. These are like the like plastic ones, the ones that pop out. It's all the Dragon Balls here. You can see that right there. Freaking awesome. Thank you. This is so cool. All right, and he also sent what? <laughs> these pack of wow. These are like Mexican bootleg figures. Okay. And they're like clear see-through things. Look at this horrible bag. Like, look at this fucking, like, card on top. Wow, take a look at that. Look at that card on top. You could tell it's like Photoshop. Like, I could do a better job at making a card for, like, a pack of figures than this, you know what I'm saying? It has, like, fan art on there and everything. That's so funny. But if you take a look at the figures here, these are, like, clear plastic uh, figures. Um, I believe there's like Super Saiyan 3, what is this? I can't even see Gotenks, I see Goku, I see Super Saiyan 4s in there. Let me take a closer look myself. I see, oh, okay, there's a Kid Buu. What is this? Is that King Cold? Looks like King Cold to me. King Cold. We got Frieza. We got Gotenks, like I said, Super Saiyan 3, Vegeta. We got Super Saiyan 4. What is that, Gogeta? Let's go Jita. We got Super Saiyan 4 Goku. We got regular Goku. We got an Ozaru right there. And then what is this? Looks like it's just a Super Saiyan Goku. So that's very interesting right here. Nice. <laughs> you know, I like my bootleg shit. So I really appreciate him sending me this. Some weird packaging right there. So thank you, Ignacio. Thank you for the gift. This is awesome. I really, really appreciate this. You know, I love this weird Dragon Ball stuff, so thank you, and thank you for the stickers. Alright, next up for the big box. This one is from Japan, and I kind of have an idea of what this is already because I kind of know what I ordered, but I'm still hyped to open it, though. Let's see what's in this big one. There's a big box right here. Okay. Oh my god, guys, ah! I've been, oh my god, the minute I saw him, I was like, I need him, I need him now. This is baby Goku, it's not baby, but kid Goku, but he is so cute, and I love him. I want to take this off, this plastic. Oh my god, guys, like... He is so adorable and he has this little belt and everything, like, I love him. Oh my god, Kid Goku right here, Dragon Ball Goku. You know, I, sometimes I feel like Kid Goku needs more love. I love, I, I think Kid Goku's adorable, like, he's just so cute. So, I'm very happy that they decided to make a large Kid Goku plush, because it really is showing some great appreciation to when he was a kid. Because, I mean, this is what started it all, you know? Look at his tail. And, like, it's just so nice to see, like, a large-scaled Kid Goku plush. How cute is that? You know I love plushies. There's a tag, says Dragon Ball, Toei sticker. This is brand new. This um, plush was recently released. So the minute I saw it, I'm like, oh, my God, I need it. And, like, 
like I said, I love like large scaled items. So this Goku is about 17 inches. Okay, with the tip of his hair, he's 17 inches, as you can see. Like he's a, a large, large plush. So I love him all. I love him. Like actually, like he's like a snuggle buddy for sure. Like he's cute. He's really cute, and he looks really good. Like it's a high quality item. So ah. <sighs> Got him from eBay. So cute. So cute. I saw only one decent price too. I was like, must buy, must buy. And there you go. Alright, so the last thing in a box that I wanted to show you is something amazing. Uh, I already opened it, but I wanted to show you guys anyways. So here it is. Put it back in the box though. And here it is. Ooh. Take a look at this, guys. This is awesome this is awesome look at this guys this is saiyan armor all right saiyan armor and i'm wearing this to kameha khan in a couple days all right this is perfection look at this you cannot tell me it's one of the best if not the best saiyan armors you've ever seen so i am so hyped to wear this look at that look at that at kameha khan i am so 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 hyped this is by the great Boba Joe, who actually made the Saiyan pod, the Saiyan capsule that is going to be at the con, the life-size Saiyan pod, he made that, okay? So I am honored to have a piece by him, like he's super talented, he works his ass off too, this guy works his fucking ass off, so I am really happy to have something by him, he is a great guy, thank you so much man for this, this is amazing, I actually have already tried it on, so... Um, some pics of me with it. It just, yeah, this is amazing. Like, I am so happy to own one of these. So I'm going to leave in the description the link to his store so you guys can check out what he has. And yes, I know he's taking a break from making stuff because he's been working so hard for this con. But hey, you can still try hitting him up, see if he gets back to you. I mean, these are well worth it. Really high quality. The way he does the paint job, it's like... And the cool part is about this is that you can literally feel that this is was made from pure scratch and took a lot of time and dedication to make something like this. So that's what I really like about it. You can feel that, you know what I'm saying, by just touching it. It's just it's true, it's true. So I cannot wait to wear this at Kamehameha Con. I'm gonna be Saiyan Goshen pretty much. So yes, yes, so awesome. I love this. And it looks beautiful on display by the way, if you're not wearing it. Alright, so that's all I have in boxes, but one more thing I wanted to show you that I got recently is this uh, Dragon Ball Z lava lamp. If you can see that right here, yep. It's a Goku themed lava lamp, and I got it at FYE. I think it was cheap. I think it was like, what, 20, 15 bucks or something. Not so bad. And I already have it up on um, display here. It's on. So I wanted to show you that real quick so you guys can look at that. Alright, guys, here's the lava lamp. Really cool picture of Super Saiyan Goku. Take a look at that. It's pretty cool. I really, really like it. So, look at your local FYE if you still have one near you and get one of your own because it's pretty cool. I never thought they were going to have like a freaking Dragon Ball lava lamp. So, yeah. Yeah, that's it guys for this unboxing. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, not like a whole bunch of stuff, but hey, still enough to entertain you guys to show you what I got recently. Trust me, there's going to be a lot more coming. And after the con, I'll, I'll definitely show you stuff that I have received um, or bought from the con and everything. Um, I'm going to make a video just for that. My Kameha Con haul video. That'll come after the con. And of course... Uh, during the con, I'll be blogging, and I, I hopefully I can edit while I'm in the hotel and like release them as as I go day by day. That would be ideal. But if you know if I can, I will do them. I'm obviously going to be blogging, and it's going to be freaking awesome. So I cannot wait to meet all of you guys that are going to the con. I actually made a Facebook event for Saturday, May 5th for the con, uh, Goshen Force meetup. Um, all of us will hang out, you know, I, I put it for like an hour, like the meetup. 
where you can hang out, we can talk, we can take pictures, selfies. That would be freaking awesome. I would love to take a group photo of everybody like, hey, Goshen Force. So I'll put that in the, in the description below as well if you want to uh, look at the event page and like say that you're going. Make sure you say that you're going to the event. It's a Facebook event page. So yes, I cannot wait to meet all of you. I cannot wait. You guys can be in my blog too. You guys will be in my blog too. Okay, if I see you, you'll be in it. So yes, so hyped. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video and until my next one, peace.